hello viewers uh, today in this video I'm going to teach you how to integrate add mobs uh, and the unity add in your game project so to integrate add mob add I'm going to use is mobile pro package so let's import this package <coughs> uh, this package is very useful as you can see mobile ads unity plugin uh, and import in this it in your project <coughs> let's check uh, so first of all we have to create scene uh, in uh, scene is also already created let's create two buttons to check that our ads are working or not so let's rename this button to unity ads and add mob add mob banner add mob interstitial <coughs> so let's uh, and canvas scale to scale its screen size sixteen hundred to nine hundred. Or let's try one to eight zero eight hundred. <coughs> Maybe not more. Let's increase their size. Unity add, add more banner. Add more interstitial. Let's change their name. Unity. Uh, best fit. Sorry, that's best fit. Add more banner, banner, and interstitial. Add more interstitial. Let's increase the size now. I think so. My packet is imported. So let's import in on the project oh <coughs> so I have imported uh, uh, imported Google mobile ads package in my project so first of all we have to we have to place this prefab in scene so that when when the game will started uh, this easy mobile will handle all the scripts uh, so let's create uh, first of all we have to turn on this advertising in easy, mo easy mobile settings so we can integrate at Kaluni, Google mobile ads, chart boost and haze app using this easy mobile so I'm only going to integrate uh, Google mobile ads so as I have already imported Google mobile ads package so here it gives the settings you can see this is iOS and Android I am currently going to run this project on Android so uh, to test uh, your ads that that they are current uh, working fine we have to use test ads so that our ad mob account will not ban so here is the banner ID uh, we have to paste it here 
and sorry uh oh and there is interstitial id so we have to paste it here currently i'm only going to integrate banner and interstitial ID. i will teach you how to integrate uh, i will check your rewarded ad and make video for it later so there is no need to check this enable test mode so there is a uh, for unity ad setup we have to turn on services of unity i'm not logging currently Let's log in. Uh, there are some options uh, default ad networks. So banner ad network we have to set it ad mob and uh, interstitial ad network. Let's set it to unity ads and uh, rewarded ad networks to unity ads and let's set it to ad mob. <coughs> So I've already have an organization. I have already a ID. Uh, select organization, and uh, let's choose anyone. I choose BMW link. I'll show yes. So turn off these ads. So now you can see here that the Unity Ad Services is enabled. Uh, so now let's create a script. To run our ads, create empty. Let's change its name to script and create a new script. The name of ad call. Let's open it. So let's see the documentation of Easy Mobile. So we have to see the add in duration, add move, add move here is add move integration test ID is uh, targeting. So there is a script we can use to call ads to show ads first of all we first of all we have to use namespace of easy mobile so I have already written here uh, using easy mobile so uh, to show banner ad we have to you can use this user guide of easy mobile so 
to do load uh, to show a banner ad you have to copy this line and paste it here let's make a function of uh, public void add mob banner so we have created a function to call banner add and let's create another function of add mob interstitial so let's see here is the script to show interstitial add This script is used to show interstitial add. We can paste it here. But first of all, we have also we have to also load the interstitial add. So there uh, manual add loading advertising dot load interstitial add. Let's also use load rewarded add we can call them on start function to load a reward okay so let's copy this function and use it also in this function so that whenever we press that button it also load first then it will show interstitial and then after showing it interstitial we will load it again so that it will show fast make another function for rewarded unity add let's see in the script so there is the here is written of rewarded into rewarded ad. We will also create a new function to destroy banner. You can also use destroy banner. So let's advertising the load the load add head load rewarded head here. We'll load also here and here. So uh, we have completed our script. Let's get back to the Unity. Let's save it. So there are no errors now. To run in this uh, Unity ads, you have to turn on services. Make sure your services are on and ads are also on. we have three buttons here I think so now things things uh, add more interstitial unity that's a real banner Let's 
activate a new button <clears throat> and rename it to destroy banner so we have created these buttons and our script is also fast so we have to select banner button and add mob banner just here add mob enter for unity unity as to destroy banner we will call destroy banner let's save it and also make sure you have easy mobile prefab in your scene otherwise your app would not run Save it and settings, play settings, company name, product name, other settings, and change your package name and ARMV7. So let's build and check it in mobile. Please, if you like my video, subscribe my channel so that I will create more videos to help you guys. And like, and if you have any question, please comment. I will answer your question. We can also remove ads. Suppose if if a user purchase, then we can remove ads by just using this line. So our APK is created. Let's copy and paste. Uh, I have I've also given the link of easy mobile package and Google mobile ads link down below you can download easy mobile from that link so let's check in mobile our ads working and now so I have opened this ads in my in my mobile let's check by clicking on banner so as you can see test banner ad appears so now let's check interstitial so test interstitial also appear and if we destroy a banner you can see a banner is hidden now we will call banner again you can see this is so fast let's test unity So you can see rewarded unity ad appears. Let's wait for this ad to finish. If you like my video, please subscribe and if you need any help, you can comment down in the section below. We can check it again. Destroy banner, banner, destroy banner, interstitial. So make sure to change live ads in Easy Mobile settings so that live ads will appear here. I'm using this test ads because Google is so strict now. I'm 